Celso Tobias has been working as a professional Santa Claus in Rio de Janeiro's shopping malls since 2016. This year he's listening to children's Christmas wishes from behind a glass window. This year we are here to protect ourselves and the children. It is different, but we can still communicate the emotion and I can tell they are happy to see Santa. But they can only see him because talking to Santa now requires an intercom speaker that needs to be constantly cleaned with alcohol. In downtown Rio, streets are packed, but few people are actually buying. Less than half of working-age Brazilians are earning an income in the third quarter of 2020, the lowest percentage on record, says Brazil's Institute of Geography and Statistics. According to a survey conducted by Brazil's National Association of Shopkeepers, only 54% of Brazilians say they plan to buy gifts this year. That is down 23% from last year. The same survey found that consumers each intend to spend an average of around $21 per gift on no more than four gifts, if they buy anything at all. We will spend less because the future is so unclear. It is not easy, and what we really want is that the COVID vaccine arrives as soon as possible. I'm not going to buy anything because I can't. I'm unemployed and receiving government aid. It's peanuts, and I can't do much with it. So there will be no gifts, no Christmas. Daniel Sakamoto from Brazil's Shopkeepers Association says the survey shows the uncertainty that millions of low-income Brazilians are experiencing. The pandemic caused a total economic collapse. Then the government's emergency aid was cut in half to less than $60 per person per month. Unemployment is high and people are barely able to cover the basics like rent, water, food and electricity. They don't have much left over to spend on gifts. As a sign of the times, prices in this part of Rio are rock bottom. Even Santa and Mrs. Claus are a bargain at more than 60% off. Lucrecia Franco, CGTN, Rio de Janeiro.